It's time for Search Mode, the new Minnesota music television show that explores the exciting world of local music. Search Mode also focuses on social issues from a particularly progressive point of view. Search Mode will feature all kinds of music from rock, jazz, blues, hip-hop, folk, slam, punk, and everything short of polka. We're looking for hot music, and we're in Search Mode. On this search mode, Scarlett Hayes as the opening act, Fort Wilson Riot at the Varsity Theater, a brand new segment with Notwell, Anthony Cox at the Artist Quarter, a music video from the Sound and Scene collection featuring Bryce, and a preview of coming attractions. A record breaking 64 degrees on November 11th as Bon Jovi comes to the Target Center. Behind the scenes, a drama has been playing out to see who would be the opening act. Unfortunately, there's only one we can choose. We'd love to choose them all, you know? But we got a winner! They're ready to kick some ass, I guess. Make a nice rock star welcome for Scarlett Hayes! I want to say one thing to the American people. I want you to listen. And I was actually thinking, I wonder if they're going to turn all the lights off. And they did. And that was one of the most amazing things I've ever experienced. Just that crowd reaction, all the lights in that place dropping. Just that roar of the crowd walking on stage. It was, it was breathtaking. Just to be able to, to showcase what we've been working towards for since we've been together, I almost don't have the words, but as the closest I can get is phenomenal. Facing 14,000 people is enough to literally take your breath away. You know, I will never forget the dry mouth syndrome that we all got. Um, we were, we came from our green room and we walked behind the stage, walked past, you know, these humongous semi-rigs, which it's just amazing to see them parked in the building, you know. 
You walk up to the stage, and then you see everybody out there, and instantly you just, your mouth goes completely dry, and you're just so void of any moisture. I told the guys, I said, drink as much water as you can, so I think we all slammed a big bottle of water. Back in their practice space a couple of days after the show, the band finally gets a chance to see their performance. They got a glimpse of it on a feature story that WCCO put together the night of the show. But this was their first opportunity to see the song that matters most to them right now. The third song in their set will be used to judge them against opening bands from the last round of Bon Jovi concerts to decide who will open at Giant Stadium when Bon Jovi returns home for the tour finale. One thing we wanted to know before we play the big song. We met the guy, we had a scheduled meet and greet right after our set and before their set and um, he shook our hands and, and uh, you know, took the time to say good job and good luck and uh, did, did you have fun? <laughs> oh God, I'm so nervous right now. <laughs> It's 3 a.m. and I had to do where I was going. You'll never trust that I can handle these things on. 